support in the final version, thankfully, because they're annoying. And that didn't work. I'm not sure if these corkscrews work at all. And they do, okay. I didn't think they would, but apparently they do. And that screws up the thing. And as you can see, the spin dash doesn't have the little, like, thing behind them. This little section is different. Um, aside from that, I mean, it, it's basically the same basic design with some slight differences that they probably changed later on for whatever reason. I'm not sure why. But overall, it's basically just the same thing. And as you can see, this one actually has a goalpost at the end. But no, like, thing at... No, like, um, stats or anything. Sorry about that, I was getting a drink of water so I don't cough the entire time. And Act 2 is finished as well, so we're going to go through this and see if we can get to the end and see what awaits us there. We got annoying snails that annoy me. I mean, that's I already said they annoyed me. Uh, I'm kind of glad that they got rid of those things. They're annoying as heck. This area is different and trollish. I was going to try to roll into that one, but apparently it didn't work. Alright. That's a different area. This area is different. <coughs> oh, hey. Eggman's machine is already here. And he's flying down from the side instead. Let's kill Robotnik. If he gets back here. Let's not die against him, because that'd kind of be stupid. Come on. And now he's dead. So he's just going to leave the remains of his machine here while he flies off. And it resets the game. Okay. So that's, you know, Starlight Zone. So let's go back and go to Scrap Brain Zone and see what we have here. And Scrap Brain Zone is Hilltop. So... Let's go up here. I'm pretty sure this lava doesn't actually damage you yet. This is probably the, like, second most, um... Uh, da 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 what's the word? The little, uh, pipes don't work. <clears throat> this is probably the second most finished level in the game. But, yeah, the lava doesn't hurt you at all yet, so... I guess that's convenient. I'd rather not die, because that kind of suck. So let's just go through this level really quick. But yeah, that's just basically what this game mainly is. It's just a lot of... Um, and I got stuck in a wall. This is why you have debug mode, people. And I'm going through the wall. Seems legit. Okay. No, get out of the wall, Sonic. You're not supposed to be there. So this is basically what the majority of the game is. As this area is the area where that um where those flowers try to squish you, but obviously that isn't here yet, so that doesn't work. And that just leads straight to death. Because the level isn't properly like at the right layer or whatever. So let's just go back. We're actually going to go to stage two because there is a different thing there that we need to show off. So, if you've played Sonic 1, then you know what happens at the end of um, Scrap Brain Zone Act 2. 
So, basically, since this level is based off of Scrap Brain Zone Act 2, what'll happen when we reach that point? Well, you'll see. It's, it's probably not going to be really as, you know, amazing as you thought it would be. But as you can see, this level's kind of, you know, screwed up. Well, I mean, all the levels are screwed up, what am I talking about? I just ran straight through the wall. Way to go. What is this place? Yeah, this, this, this place looks finished. That's the place where the lava rose in the original. But we should be reaching that point soon. Yep. As soon as you reach that point, the game freezes. So let's... Reset. I'm hoping that that keeps my cheat codes. Okay, it does. And let's let's go to Final Zone, just for the heck of it. And that spawns us... in Hilltop. And... That freezes the game. Okay. Well, that doesn't work, so let's reset again. And now let's go to Spring Yard, because we never went to Spring Yard. So... I said reset. Uh, okay, uh, yeah, the game crashing in Final Zone kind of turned off my cheat code, so I'm gonna have to turn them on again. Hooray. C, 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 up, down, 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 up. Up, down, 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 up, start. No? Okay. Well, debug mode is on. Alright, level select. Up, down, 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 up. Start. There we go. So let's go to Spring Yard Zone. Welcome to Hidden Palace Zone, as it should be. Yes, this is what that glitchy mess of a level is supposed to look like. And as you can see, an entirely new robot right there, which is like a Tyrannosaurus. And that's a little thing. And you go through, there's a bridge. There's a Tails monitor, that makes sense. Got a little thing there. Some new bat enemies. This this level's actually pretty finished as well. So yeah. And there's that little glitchy bridge that we were on. Except now it's not all glitchy. Or it might have been that one. I don't know. It was one of those bridges. Right here. And this right here is where your journey ends, unless you have debug mode. Where you have like some really good skills. Can I pro this up? Can I be pro? No. Oh, I just proed that so much. Alright. Let's go up here. Jump around, up that. And now we're up here. Over here is a dead end. Over here. Oh, hey! This, this looks like a thing. If you've played Sonic 3, you know what that is. And why is it here? Well, it's already been proven that basically this is just like a thing that you were supposed to break in order to enter this pipe right here, which leads to nowhere. So it's kind of pointless. But as you can see over here, there's not much more, just some pointless, like, whatever. And right here you have like a little, like, weird section that goes straight up. And basically what this does is it will basically... I'm not sure if that's actually in this version or not, but... Oh yeah, it is. It'll just continue up from this direction and go up. And then you enter this little area with the water slides. And at the end of the water slides is the end of the level. So, yep. That's that's basically what Hidden Palace Zone is. And there's nothing else at all. So, yep. That's Hidden Palace Zone in a nutshell. So, that's basically everything we need to show in this. So, yeah, now that we're done with the Nick Arcade prototype, we're going to go to the Simon Y prototype. So, I'll see you right back in that one. 
what? No Sega? That's interesting. So, this right here is the Simon Y prototype. And as you can see, this one actually has a functioning two-player, which as you can see, this is kind of like what it was supposed to be when I was showing off two-player in the other one. But, yeah, this is basically the Simon Y prototype, which is a lot further in into development. As you can see, Sonic's run, like, thing isn't the same thing, but he still has the, like, little swirly legs. The little snail things are still existent, but the level's kind of different. But I need to check what the... Oh, there's the Sega. I need to check what the things are. So, level select is hold A and press start. So let's do that. That was easy. And as you can see, there's actually, me like, the correct music playing. And there's a ton of levels listed here, which a lot of them aren't the same thing, so yeah. But we need to turn on debug mode as well, so we're going to go back. Debug mode is essentially like the same thing as, um, it's basically the same code as the other prototype, but instead of pressing C four times, you press it twice. So let's CC, up, down, 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 up. A, start. Alright, now we should be in. So, let's start from the top and work our way down, shall we? Alright, Green Hill Zone. And Green Hill Zone is Emerald Hill Zone. That's pretty obvious. And I wanted to show that thing. As you can see, this 